Hey, hey, this nigga brought out the box. Hey, let's let's go. Go. About to lose it. Freedom. Hit him with the Diddy Bop. You know what's funny? I watched the uh the uh what's that video? Godzilla. Every them Godzilla song we're gonna be watch that shit. And when he says something about Diddy, you see a nigga in the dance, nigga, nigga in the dance, nigga in the back doing the Diddy. <laughs> I got cheese and I got getting I got some bands I got getting cheese and cakewalk, but he in the back uh, doing the Diddy. Look at hilarious. Oh shit. That's an easy dance to do. <laughs> Fucking easy. Oh. My bad, the reaction was so late. You know what? I was kind of confused. I was like, shit. I want there's a song I wanted to do. Because I heard it before. I was like, damn, how I'ma do this shit. So I'm gonna, you know, fucking just fucking wing it, whatever. Because um I'm gonna do it next week. I'm gonna do it next week. It'll be next week, Monday's video. That's um Drips from Eminem. <laughs> Drips from the Eminem show. I can't believe I'm getting time tied. This is crazy. From the Eminem show, right? And the reason why I want to do that song, the fucking beat is garbage. Oh man, the beat is garbage. I do not like that fucking beat at all. My cousin used to always try to make me listen to it, and I would. He would play it, and I would never re-listen to it. I I just zone out. <laughs> One day, he played it, and I couldn't zone out because I I couldn't stand the beat. So I started listening. I'm gonna wait till you no. Know I'm just gonna wait till I do the video. I'm gonna finish that story when I do when I Monday. Y'all gotta wait. Cliffhanger. <laughs> All right. Before we get into this Eminem, DMX, OB Trice, I can't believe Eminem and DMX got a song together, man. You know what the bitches were all for, my nigga? That nigga made a whole verse about names, bro. DMX, in case you're wondering who I'm talking about. Damn. That nigga even. I gotta react to DMX shit because that nigga, 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 nigga Damien. And Damien, too, and Damien, bruh. Don't get me started on fucking damn Max, nigga. Everybody knows. That nigga DMX is lyrical. Lyrical as fuck. Just like Ludacris, lyrical as fuck. I gotta do some Luda too. Um before we get into this. Let's get into this. Wait, shit, I wanna do something different. Should I point now? I do the point a lot. Eh. What the fuck should I do? Should I snap? Do they got a snap opening? I'm fucking, I'm gonna make it work. Look at that. <laughs> I've been waiting for this song to get picked. I've been waiting. I was like, oh, I can't wait for D12 to get. I've been waiting. <laughs> it is old. I'm just, bruh. Bruh. Yeah, now how am I gonna get out? Do the wipe again? Maybe I can do this. Maybe it worked. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Go to sleep. I'm excited. Eminem and Dan Max on the track. How did I not see this shit, bro? Like, yo, what the? F Shout out to everybody for supporting my channel, man. Y'all keep doing that work. I'm gonna keep bringing this work. Let's get it. Whoa, whoa, whoa! The B got the funerals. Who? Oh shit! It's gotta be some battle type shit. Gotta be. It's gotta be. Oh shit! 
Hold on, nigga. Hold on, nigga. Mm-mm. Everybody just bow your head. You know that how they say you gotta pray before you eat. We all about to eat. Everybody bow your heads. Hey, are you bowing your heads? If you're not with that, cool. Do whatever you with. But if you with this, bow your heads. Let's say this prayer. Lord Jesus, do not let this nigga M kill us today. We come from far away over the lands. We got people in the UK, people in New York, people in Miami, people in LA. I'm just naming all the major states because that's all I can remember right now. If I missed you, I'm sorry. I missed a whole bunch of other states. There's 50 of them. My bad. And even the people outside of the states, I don't want to forget about y'all. Eminem even got motherfuckers listening to him in Africa. You know what Africa is. It's black people out there. A little bit of mixture of white, but they're all listening to him. That nigga is worldwide. Lord, help and guide me through this damn reaction. In your name I pray. Amen. Let's go. Gonna eat, I ain't gonna sleep. Ain't gonna breathe till I see what I wanna see. And what I wanna see is you go to sleep in the dirt permanently. You just being hurt. This ain't gonna work for me. It just wouldn't be. I'm glad I said that prayer in the beginning. That nigga said, All I wanna do is see you go to sleep in the dirt permanently. And I like how that beat came in when he said permanently. Bruh. Who the fuck is he talking about? He didn't say nothing to let me know who he's talking about. All right. As you go to sleep in the dirt permanently, you just being hurt. This ain't gonna work for me. It just wouldn't be sufficient enough because we are just gonna be enemies. As long as we breathe, I don't ever see either of us coming to terms where we can agree. There ain't gonna be no reason speaking with me. You speak on my seat, then me no speaking English. So we gonna beef and keep on beefing in less. I know what you think I'm talking about. Whoa! You speak up, I see me, you don't speak New England. <laughs> Yo! Yo! Think it's the meet me. You speak up, I see me, you don't speak English. <laughs> Not English. English? Bruh. Ingles, nigga, talking about Benzino, big head ass. That nigga got like thirty songs talking about Haley, nigga, and none of them good. Ain't that some shit? How you have 30, 30 disses, and only nigga can say something about you what you said about Haley, and what you said about Haley is not even good. It just the fact that you, it just the part that you said Haley, you said her name Haley, is the reason why a nigga said anything about your bar. Trash, nigga. Trash. But everybody has one good son. I'm not one of those people that just because of this nigga going at it with somebody that I instantly hate the old catalog. That's not how I do it. I, I, I'm I'm in love with hip hop. You know, fuck what it is. Like, I got into it. Not really get into it. But I was going back and forth with one of, uh, wasn't even an argument. It was weird. But I was going back and forth with one of my uh, subs, right? And that nigga was talking about job. I grew up. Listening to Ja. So I, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and say, oh that nigga Ja was running shit at one point in time. Just like I told his ass. He told me he said uh uh who will win in the versus battle between him and, and Ja. And I told that nigga, don't sleep on Ja. Ja got hits, my nigga. Eminem doesn't make hits. Eminem make music, he's lyrical. He makes shit that you can relate to. That the half the shit that I reacted to. It's not even on the fucking radio. He doesn't do this for hits. He do this to vent. That's what music is supposed to be about. To vent. To vent about what's going on in your life. Your frustration. How you see things. And that's why I fuck with him. Because, and all the other lyrical people. 
That's why I fuck with him. But Ja, that nigga was in the limelight. That nigga, that nigga got hit. I would never discredit his ass. I never, I would never say Ja is lyrical because Ja is not lyrical. But Ja can rap. That's a difference. That's a huge difference. Take that what you will. I don't care. I'm not going to argue with you. Argue with somebody else. I'm not going to argue. That's not my style. But I I would never discredit somebody for doing some shit that I can feel. I mean, if I listen to the person, yes. If you don't listen to them, cool. Because I can't speak on certain people I don't listen to. Like, um, I give y'all one, which I won't see me uh, commenting on it or nothing. Y'all won't, even, y'all won't even see me do nothing about their music. Maybe I said everybody got one song or just one song. And it's only the reason why I would do that one song. But that nigga Future, I don't like the nigga Future. I don't like the way he rap. I, I, I don't like him at all. But I'm not going to go on his shit and express I don't like him. He, he, he's getting the bag. That's cool. The song up, Mask Off. That, that fucking beat is dope. But I only like the song because of the remix. Kendrick Lamar. That's it. That's the only future shit I like. Other than that, I throw his whole catalog up. I hurt your feelings. Shit. I don't care. I'm gonna get back into this. So we gonna beef and keep on beefing unless you're gonna agree to meet with me in the flesh and settle this face to face, and you're gonna see a demon unleashed in me that you never seen, and you're gonna see this gangster be on himself. You speak on my C, me don't speak English. I see you D12, but thanks, but me need no help. You know how you know how you talk to somebody and English is not their first language, so they talk low key, they talk ebonics. So you talk ebonics and then but you're not trying to talk about trying to talk proper, but it come out of ebon- Me no need no help. Huh? The fuck you say to me? That's like an M is dope. He could have just said, I don't, I see you do 12, but thanks, I don't need no help. But me, don't need no help. Nigga, but me? Don't need no help. Nigga, I got this shit. Nigga, sit back, have some popcorn. Nigga, have some grapes or something. I don't know. Eat healthy, get some fruit. Face to face and you're gonna see A demon unleashed in me that you never seen And you're gonna see this gangster be on himself I see you D12 and thanks, but me need no help Me do this one on my own Nigga, nigga, just like I said in one of my other videos, nigga, like sometimes you you just gotta take a break and walk off, bro. God damn, he got me sweating. How the hell he got me sweating? Now he ain't even talking about me. That's fucked up. Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> that's fucking crazy yeah i think it said jai you get it too because i remember what Ja said something about hating hey m you know what's funny it's funny that i'm doing this reaction video to this song and he mentioned Ja, and i just seen a clip for Ja on uh mad podcast that's fucking crazy and i remember the exact words he said m is a juggernaut i did that I did that. He didn't say he beat him. He just said, I, that nigga know. That nigga know. That nigga know. Like, that nigga know. That's all you can say is, that nigga know. And clapback was kind of nice. I like clapback. But that nigga know. Hey, M, your mom's a crackhead and M and Kim is a known slut. So what's Haley going to be when she grows up? Nigga, he lost it. Nah, I ain't gonna do that. <clears throat> I ain't gonna do that. Let's let this go. Yeah, 
here, bitch. What? is the African rapper who ja, who was who they accused Josh still of some of his lyrics. That's who Cool Hurst is, 2003. Obi's kind of referenced him in a couple of his raps. If you just do a couple of his songs, he does reference him in a couple of his raps, but Ja was stealing. That's why he said that, just in case you don't get that bar. Use no threat. Who's your servant when lyrically or the bird you beneath the dirt when you fuck with a label overseeing the earth? Shady motherfucker, old Trice's birth. Mm. And as I mold, I become more cursed. So we can put down the verse, take it to the turf, cock and squeeze. And he who reached the hearse is he who. Nigga said, as I mold, curse. But nigga, we can take it to the. T n Ooh. Nigga. Obi. Ooh. Fucker old Trice's birth. And as I mold, I become more cursed. So we can put down the verse. Take it to the turf. Cock and squeeze. And he who reached the hearse is he who depicts fiction in his verse. And as I breathe, and you be deceased. The world believe you deceive just to speak. Use not the streets. Use the desk. Use not your chest, nigga. Use a vest before two shoes your rest. You chose death. Six feet deep, nigga. That's the death. Now go to sleep, bitch. You see how that nigga subtly switched from Ja to Benzino? Nigga, you not the streets? You can take it that when that and he said take it to the turf, nigga, that was the switch. And start talking about ben, nigga, Obi is fucking nice. And M came in the beginning, he's like, you know what? I'm just gonna light tap these niggas. I'm gonna light tap these niggas. For the fuck of it. But I'm gonna let y'all get y'all shit off y'all chest. Even though he light tapped these niggas, he still fucked them up. Even and what's crazy about this shit is he fucked Ja up and he only said his name once at the end. And he said it, he said fucking eight words probably. All of you. And Ja you'll get to who fucked him up. I don't know why it just feels so much worse when he said somebody's name. Maybe because of the potential that of what he can fucking do. Well, we've seen the aftermath of Ja. <laughs> Rude, that is. Which is kind of clever. His name was Jeffrey, Jeffrey Aiken, so it's like Ja Rule. I remember all that shit. Man, I'm telling you, I'm a lover of hip hop. I'll follow all that shit. You think, you think M listened to one side of a fucking beef? He listened to all his old school niggas. So if you love hip hop, yes, it's cool to have your favorite, your favorite artist. That's fine. That's fine. You might be like, oh, if I go support this. No. It's, uh, he's the reason why this person is this way. So you should go. You should go support that a little bit. To make him come back and he'll fuck him up again. I mean, that's the essence of rap. You battle. You battle rap. You put your skills against anybody else. It's just It's no different from football or any type of sport. Baseball, soccer, fucking uh, cricket. <laughs> Shit, miniature golf. Shit, <laughs> they have miniature golf tournaments. Like, damn, there's no different. Just like if a little competitive nature is not bad for the game, it only helps it. So, like I was saying, M listen to all the old school artists, KRS ones, and all them niggas, Big L, and all them, all them niggas. The niggas that have beef with other people. You think they listen to them niggas too? You listen to all that. How else you gonna learn from the game? Hey. I mean, I know M got his fan base. That, that's fucking dope. You post up your fan base. You support what you want to support. But sometimes, <laughs> sometimes, when a nigga, would like, when you listen to somebody uh, go out your favorite artist, you can't help but get excited. Because you see this person go out your artist, your favorite artist, and you're like, oh, I can't, I know this nigga gonna fuck him. I can't wait. And then when he comes out and he fucks him up, you like I told you. Then you see everybody else agreeing with you. Like yeah, he fucked him up. Like yeah, like just think about how MGK happened. <laughs> MGK, MGK came, said the stupid shit. Oh, okay. 
Rap Devil coming out soon. Leave it at that. Those deaths, six feet deep, nigga, that's the death. Now go to sleep, bitch. Die, motherfucker, die. Yeah, Mitch's voice is just so fucking dope. What? Hold on, 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 nigga. Dear Mitch has got that iconic fucking voice. I mean, I used to love when it be like, it's weird, but I used to love when it be on the track and you know he's on it. Before he comes to rap, he growls. That shit was fucked, man. Like, one of my favorite verses, I did a reaction to it already. One of my favorite verses uh, from that nigga from um, 24 Hours to Live. 24 left before my death. I'm a church out of life. But some shit like, I, gotta, I ain't heard that shit in a minute. I gotta, uh, I gotta go refresh. I know exactly where I'm going, but I'm gonna send you to work. And the shit I've been doing, well, I know exactly what I'm doing. I'm gonna see you there first. And the shit that I be doing, I'm gonna send you there worse. Bruh. I think M first bird just to play off of that damn 24 hours. Demon curse. Yeah, OB. I, I, wow. I didn't think I just talked myself into a new idea. That's dope. That's dope. Stay place in New York with the heat. Yeah. Stalked on a beat. Yeah. Walk with my feet. Uh. Understand my pain. The rain ain't sweet. What? Peep how oh. oh, this nigga did it, man. Understand, nigga, the rain ain't sweet. Whoa. This nigga. It's, 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 I'm stuttering like a motherfucker. I can't even get my damn thoughts out. The rank ain't sweet. This nigga. This nigga did. Meth got a song. Rang. Murder Inc. And Murder Inc. got a song. Murder was rang. The rank ain't sweet. But also the rain. His song. The rain. Oh my. And that shit all my reactors now. I'm gonna say something crazy. What? It's over. It's over. Stalked on a beat, yeah. Walk with my feet. Uh, understand my pain. The rain ain't sweet. What? Peep how I'm moving. Uh -huh. Peep where I'm going. Uh -huh. Did you wait? <laughs> Stump with my feet. Walk on a beat. But the beat sound like somebody stumping and walking. Spanish lyricism. What? On a beat, yeah. Walk. Stay place in New York with the heat, yeah. Stalked on a beat, yeah. Walk with my feet. Uh. Understand my pain. The rain ain't sweet. What? Peep how I'm moving. Uh -huh. Peep where I'm going. Uh -huh. Shit, don't sleep then sleep not knowing. Oh. But I'ma keep growing, getting larger than life. Easy going, but the same one that started the fight. He be knowing how dark. Show you dog shit. Don't, don't fight, nigga. Grand champ. Do you know what a grand champ, nigga? That's when a dog win them damn dog fights, bro. The motherfuckers like I think it's like five of the motherfuckers. He win like five of them bitches, nigga. Bloodline. You know what kind of dog DMX is? He ain't no motherfucking poodle. Or no chihuahua. Or more teeth. That nigga's a dog, nigga. That nigga's a pity. That nigga's a pity. I remember that video when that nigga was like, look, 
I knew he was high when he was talking on the damn shit, but he was like, look, that nigga showed his ugly ass pinky toe and was like, I'm turning into a dog. I was like, this nigga high as hell. But I still fuck with him, though. Good job, bitch ass. Seeing that nigga in the club. I remember that shit because DMX is talking about that shit, bro. I know my information. DMX seen Ja a couple of weeks earlier. He was hanging out with that nigga. They was buddy buddy. Nigga, like, what's up, nigga? And then a nigga Ja came into a club. DMX was already there. Ja didn't want to show a nigga love because this is when Ja was the height of his shit. Basically, he cheat. Did you hear that recent story that that nigga cheated himself out of the Fast and Furious series? Fucking idiot. That nigga could have been making millions doing Fast and Furious movies. I mean, I know people tired of him, but fuck. You would have been collecting that damn check? Because he, because what was it? Uh, 50,000, some, some shit. Some shit was too low. You stupid. Nigga, only thing, only, nigga, only shit niggas know you for, no, Monica. That's it, nigga. Dumb decisions. Anyways. He didn't show that nigga DMX blood. DMX was really pissed off about it because he's like, I was fucking with that nigga. Then you know how this shit go. The rest play out, nigga. Track for track, nigga. Dog, why you had to do them niggas like that? Nigga, leave DMX alone. I know DMX, rest in peace. I love DMX. He always got a son speaking to the Lord. Lord, give me a son, bruh. Well, son, that brought tears to my eyes because it was after what happened to my cousin. Hey, yo, Kato. Nigga, oh man, them lyrics, them motherfuckers hit. Let me stop before I start tearing up. Let's get back happy. Track, damn dog, why you had to do the niggas like that? Go to sleep, bitch. Nah, motherfucker, die. Uh, time's up, bitch. Close your eyes. Go to sleep, bitch. What? Wow, you still alive? How many times I gotta say close your eyes? Go to sleep, bitch. What? Die, motherfucker, die. Bye, bye, motherfucker, bye, bye. Go to sleep, bitch. What? Wow, you still alive? <laughs> It's funny. I, I think this is the second time I heard. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> he said, nigga, I fucked you up in the first verse. I don't even want to rap no more. I'm just going to talk now. You know what that remind me of? Everybody should. I mean, not everybody. Most niggas should have seen The Wash. They got a song called uh, D12, Blow My Buds. That song is in there. Eminem, schizophrenia. How many of you got it? How many? That shit is so fucking hard. That, I love that damn song. I gotta do a reaction to it, but it could be... I don't remember. Kind of. I'm gonna do a reaction to it, but I heard it. I'm gonna let y'all know right now, I heard that song before. So it's not gonna be like me walking around and all that shit. I heard that song before. It's gonna be just like Stan. Still dope. I heard it before. Still dope. Anyways. In that movie. That nigga uh, was, uh, went to the car wash to get the ransom. And uh dude put up in a uh, security guard. He was like, oh, that's a motherfucking rental cop. And then M come with the ski mask with the K. He was like, oh, that ain't no rental cop right there. Cop got hit. That shit had me in tears. And then when he was shooting, I saw that's the only place I see. Mm. That nigga. That nigga M is stupid. That nigga can act. That nigga's funny. We're
no more press to shot at uh the source magazine but that nigga said decay rock in the dirt die nameless he said he's gonna put you niggas in an unmarked grave nobody's gonna find you nigga It was so bad he could have said that shit in his verse, but he was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm going to say it like this. Let's see if the niggas catch on. And guess what? We caught on. (laughs) 